Hello everybody, today we're going to take a quick look at A Quiet Place, starring John Krasinski, Emily Blunt, and Millicent Simmons. In A Quiet Place, the world has been overrun by these vicious aliens that are slowly but surely killing off the human race. As these aliens are blind, they hunt us by sound and not by smelling our fear, thank God. The story follows a family of five, give or take, as they try to survive in what's left of this world. Very interesting movie. Uh, not a lot of spoken dialogue, I should say. There's a lot of dialogue in the movie, but I think all of the spoken words could fit on one page. Most of it is done through sign language. The family that we follow in this movie has a hearing-impaired daughter, played by Millicent Simmons, and her disability pretty much ends up saving their lives. And it's interesting to see just how well they have adapted to this new world. They all know American Sign Language, so they can communicate with one another without making a sound. They walk around barefoot and try to always stay on a dirt path or a carpet, at least as much as possible. It's nice to see people in a horror movie who are actually intelligent and have good survival instincts. That being said, I did have to wonder why there were a few moments in this movie where they didn't just close the goddamn doors. I know closing the doors makes noise, but... Sometimes you gotta take a calculated risk. But anyway, despite how well they have adapted, they are still constantly in mortal danger. Especially since the mother, played by Emily Blunt, has a bun in the oven, and babies are not exactly known for being quiet. Women giving birth are not exactly known for being quiet. It's not really a silent process. So, yeah, that's something to worry about. But again, because these are actually very intelligent people, they have a really well-thought-out plan for dealing with this. Unfortunately, they're in a horror movie, so you know everything is not going to go exactly as they planned. Krasinski not only stars in the film, but co-wrote the screenplay and directed as well, and I thought he did a fantastic job. You can practically taste the tension in this movie. I was totally on the edge of my seat the whole time. I love the atmosphere created by the silence and the abject terror that arises with the slightest possible sound. This movie gets so intense that during one of the quiet scenes, some asshole in the theater apparently forgot to turn his cell phone off and it actually rang and for a brief moment there I thought our number was up. But then I realized, oh yeah, it's a movie, we're fine. And then I thought his number was up because I was about to strangle the motherfucker for not turning off his phone. Do you, why is it so hard to not turn off your phone? Giant movie in front of you, that means turn the phone up. I digress. The acting was pretty solid, including the children, and pretty much the entire movie is just spent following these five, give or take, people, and they all work together very well. Krasinski and Blunt both did a great job. I suppose it would make sense that a real-life married couple could play a convincing married couple on screen. And I was especially impressed with Millicent Simmons. She was awesome in this movie. I remember thinking after the movie was over, is she legitimately deaf or just a really good actress? And the answer is both. I just enjoyed the shit out of this movie. It's one of the best I've seen so far this year, and I can recommend it without hesitation. I'm definitely looking forward to Krasinski's next project, and I hope we see more of Simmons as well. And that's it for A Quiet Place. Till next time, take care.